Hey everyone, we're going to take a look at a pretty unique travel trailer. This is the Trail Runner 31DB and it actually comes in weighing at 9,642 pounds with a length of 36 feet 11 inches. So just starting with the outside first, you got your power tongue jack here at the front two propane tanks just behind there and you also have diamond plating uh, running at the bottom of your front cap to just help protect it i also love the design it's nice and smooth and then you have your aluminum siding uh, over here coming to our camping side you have some pass-through storage front and rear power stabilizer jacks and you also have the three-year limited structural warranty huge power awning uh, so you can relax especially if it's a pretty hot day or if it happens to be raining on your vacation outside speakers um, access to your water heater uh, you got a cable plus some power as well and then solid steps at your entrance with the oversized grab handle you also have an outside kitchen, which is definitely something that is on a lot of people's checklists. Uh, mini fridge, open space for your plates and utensils, and then you have a stainless steel griddle. On the back is a spare tire, and you are prepped for a uh, observation camera if you would like to have one. Outside shower, city water connection, and then you have one slide out on your non-camping side. Of course, that's where you can dump all your tanks. And I think that covers the outside. Let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. So coming all the way to the front and working our way towards the back, you have your master bedroom, queen size bed, and it does have some additional storage underneath the mattress. End tables are on both sides, and these little circles right here are actually charging uh, ports for your phone. So all you have to do is just place your phone on top of it and it charges it for you, which is pretty awesome. Above each, you have a closet locker with a built-in clothes rack. Shelf that extends across for some extra storage or some decorations if you like. And then if you can see, you have open cubbies on each side so you can place your snacks in there, your phones, uh, reading glasses, anything that you want. Barn style sliding door for some extra privacy. And then over here to my left, you have a spot for a TV bracket so you can have one in here. And if you needed the extra storage space for your clothes, you have more couple shelves and drawers, plus some open cubbies underneath. Coming out behind this door is our bathroom. So you have a couple open shelves. As soon as you um, open the door here on the left, you can put some decorations or toilet paper, stow away your washcloths, towels, anything that you want. And then you got your sink with more storage down below, power, plus your medicine cabinet. Across from your sink is your foot flush toilet. And then lastly is our shower. Plenty of room to turn around in. You got a nice skylight uh, for some natural light coming in. Even some hooks to hang up your towels. Coming out to the main living portion of our camper, I would like to say one thing that I noticed is how light and bright that this camper is. You have a lot of windows for some natural light, but even the colors too, I think are absolutely gorgeous. You have this natural uh, wood tones and then you have the white plus the darker wood tones. I just think it looks great. On the other side of the wall um, from your bathroom is starting your kitchen. So storage is down below. 50-50 split stainless steel sink. A really cool looking backsplash as well. Huge window so you can still be a part of all the action even when you're inside cooking. And then before I forget, our price comes out to be $33,985 for everything. Just up above, you have some cabinets. And then this is also textured too. It has like vertical lines on it. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it. It just looks really cool. Stainless steel microwave graystone range hood and then you have your three burner stove top with this glass range cover and there is your oven pretty big refrigerator as well I'll show you the freezer across from there is your booth dinette very comfortable great for uh, family dinners or board game nights anything like that and i would like to point out too that the slide out Flooring material is not carpet. It's almost like an outdoor rug. Uh, so we'll definitely sweep up pet hair very easily. All these windows are covering this slide out too. Uh, USB ports are kind of everywhere and outlets to charge electronics. Next to your booth dinette, 
you have your sofa. The middle cushion folds down into um, cup holder placement places, uh, so you can do that. Or if you'd rather have it folded up for more seating, you can do that. And the booth dinette plus the sofa folds out into sleeping space for your friends or kids wanting to stay with you. Across the way is your entertainment center. Uh, more cabinets down below. Open cubby space. And then you have a spot for a TV bracket. And then just right there is the uh, speaker system to access your inside and outside speakers. More storage up above. And then here is our main entrance. You also have a closet space as soon as you walk in. Put some extra stuff in there. And then the best part for last, behind this barn style sliding door... You have a really awesome bunk room. So your bottom bunk is considered a double bunk. And then you have your single on top. But this can sleep two people if you'd like or three, um, kind of depending on size. And this is also rated for 275 pounds. So a full-size adult is able to sleep up here too. And then just next to that, you have some closet cabinet space. Nice window for some more natural light. And even more storage over here on the right. It's also a spot where the TV can go in here. So your kids can have a TV to play games, uh, watch movies, TV, anything like that. And if you're worried about them having to go all the way up front to use your bathroom, they actually have their own half bath, which is really awesome. Uh, toilet directly across. Then you got your sink with power. Uh, storage down below and those open cubby spaces again so really awesome that they have their own little nook space right here uh, really they can close the door and you won't even have to see them for the whole camping trip so there you have it this is the trail runner 31 at db uh, any sort of questions or concerns feel free to let us know and we'll be happy to help